we're making assembling machines now. Okay, cool. We're making all inserts, assembling machines, all the tier one belt stuff. Okay. Now what? Uh, uh, maybe, drills, maybe, maybe electric it, drills. Maybe it's time to make the t the gun stuff. Because if we're thinking about fighting, maybe we need to automate making gun turrets. Okay, yeah. And gun then automate and making gun turret rifle ammo. And then I'll do the research of the new weapons, which will give us the armor piercing rifle ammo, and I'll make the steel. Okay. And I'll get the steel coming down on the belt. How about that? that sound. Uh, yep. Sound like okay. a thing, and you've left so the, the, you've left left, the belt. Yeah, for the far steel. left one here this is the steel belt. If it, once steel goes into this, it'll start making the fast inserts. Okay, cool. I think all of this is very doable. I think the steel also should be very very easy to make because it is just it's quite a simple process. I think okay, it's just good. Wood and iron. So this is these are gonna make Coke, Coca Cola. Coke, Coca Cola. And we're going to use burner mine burner inserters because screw bringing power poles over to this side. This needs the wood on the belt, so I'm going to have to go and get the wood belt from your greenhouses, which means I'm going to have to run a, a conveyor belt through most of the base. But that's okay; it's already here, so not too bad. Um. Railway finished. Nice. Yay. So I need the steel beams and steel plates. So I'm working on that. Excited for that. And then um, we we'll go, go for weapons next. Yeah. And I think maybe we'll see if we can get any weapons that are relatively cheap. <coughs> cheap weapons. Right? Nothing better than a cheap weapon. <laughs> Don't want anything too fancy. We want like the cheapest way to kill these bugs and most efficient right man i really am impressed that we haven't had well not impressed but i'm worried that we haven't been attacked properly because i th i feel like it might be because normally you get like that they build up right yeah they are but we got rid of the closest one which stopped that initial first attack by a long time i think i'm just worried that like, should, like maybe start. they attack in a bigger strength you know in this Right. You know what I'm saying? This is a bit worrying. Because <laughs> I don't want them to just totally overwhelm us and like completely destroy everything. Because that will be game over. I'm automating gun turrets now. Um, just, just them, them automation cores. This is so interesting. Because these things I'm building here, effectively they can kind of look after themselves do you mean like you just they power themselves with coke or coal or whatever yeah and the burner mining drills mean they don't need any power like the whole thing is powered by coal but these yeah. ones don't use coal they use coke but the coke powers them anyway they make the coke well these ones make the coke and these ones use the coke mm. both to for the steel and to power them that's fun and so it's like a double whammy steel steel is being made be glad okay. to hear. Is it going on the belt? No, but it is. Will be. It will. Do you be. know where the belt is? No, but it. Um, where would you like it to go? I think it will be right next to the iron one for now. Right next to the iron okay. and the copper ones. But I could bring. Okay. It. If you have it to the right of the iron one, then I can use that quite easily. Can you possibly? do use this steel to make the track for me so i need track railway track yes yeah okay let's see what that costs where is that ah okay so it's steel and stone right steel and stone okay now there is stone i can bring the stone down to you as well if you need that sure yeah. bring that over and i'll start making track steel and stone the, uh, should Oh, D. There we go. Get rid of that forest. <laughs> There's a forest in the way. <laughs> fuck those. Fuck that nature. We're about to hit one of the nests with pollution. Yeah. So I feel like we should probably head up and stop that. You think? Now. Yeah. 
So let's grab some gun turrets and some anti-material rifle bullets and try and fuck up that. Yeah, how are we going to perform against these guys, do you think? Well, let's make a little battle. Have we got any walls? Yeah, we do. We make some. Oh, we need stone bricks for that. Okay, we haven't got any walls. Well, we shouldn't need walls. So Gun I started blasting. No problem. Uh, Anti-material rifle magazines. Uh, X. No. What's change weapon tab? Tab. Okay. I'm blasting. You might want to blast the bases actually, Duncan, with your rifle. Yeah, I am. Yeah, it does good damage. Oh wow, these are so easy at this stage. These are no problem. All right. There's another one. There's nothing that was that close though to the pollution. You don't have to worry about them for a while. It took a it took a bit of damage. There's one to the west we might want to look into. Sorry, I'm just harvesting the creep. Oh yeah. <laughs> creep. <laughs> yeah, I, I think we need quite a bit of it. I didn't even use my grenades. I need to get rid of this creep. I don't think you can build on the creep either. You want to get go to the one on the left? Are we going to clear yeah, out all of these? It's pretty close. This one's pretty close, so. It's Okay, I'll come out, help. I think. I think we should work together on these. Just because I think an extra body is makes it so much easier. Oh, Shift-C doesn't work for giving them ammo. No, that's annoying. Yeah, I have not found a good way to, like, fill those, you know? I tend to always do it manually, and that's not ideal. Oops. I've got a couple of damaged ones here. Right, you start blasting those nests. Get that fucking rock. These are, these are pathetic, these low-level ones. Now, I have got a mod on which makes them much harder as the game oh, goes God. on. So, okay. consider that. It's called, like, Armoured... I wonder armored, if we want to... Yeah, armored we get this one to the north as well, because that's kind of close, too. Yeah, let's get this one to the north, then we can have a little scout around for potential um, iron veins to the north. Yeah, it'd be nice to have the factory expanding to the <laughs> south, and yet... Oh, my God, are you okay? No. Don't die. Okay, oh my god. Oof. Actually was barely even wounded there. Oh, you look bad on my screen. <laughs> uh, yeah, these Sorry. initial... I guess it's because they haven't had any pollution. So what they do is, when they get hit by pollution, they send out... They build up for an attack. They don't actually send out an attack immediately. Well, yeah. sometimes they do, but they, they build up and they grow, and they get worse and worse. So unless you do this actively um, and also as the game goes on they do just spawn in areas close to you yeah he's, he's got to clean them out so they don't get near the pollution I think that's, that's man key. it's been really easy like I'm not used to having them so easily cleared out because normally when I'm fighting them they've got like 50 fucking artillery spitters in them and all yeah this they're garbage. fucking horrible aren't they god right so I'm going to run home see the copper ore I think is there um, but like so weird that there's no iron to the north at all I know we well, really have to go a long way to get that I'm iron I'm going to come back and we're going to we're going to build trains there's some big nests in between us and the iron as well well do you need me to go and start working on them well I think we need bigger guns to get past that or at least more guns well okay. we you're building the gun turrets okay that's good yeah I'll get an ammo thing building as well just, just rifle ammo is rifle ammo is fine for coal. now. I need coal on this belt then, fuck. Okay, I'll go get that. And then, um, bloody hell. And then rails are the next thing. Can you get those? Yeah, so rail, I'll get the ammo and then the rails. And you can do the rails now, I think. Probably. I, I, I would reckon. I just want the ammo to be next to the gun, really, so. Well, just build the rails a bit lower then. Okay, so. This is a very long, it's a long, a long shop. A very it long is a long shop. shop. I kind of want to put it all together in one place at some point. Which I probably I might do. Alright, so pipes. Line gear wheels and plates. That makes the engines. I just need to make sure there's some iron coming down to these boys. Which there sort of isn't. Because the iron is coming in so slow. Oh my god. Yeah. But don't worry. We're going to train back so much iron ore and put it through a mega factory a mega forge a forge 
Is it the better Mega to train Forge. back the? Is it better to to cook it in situ? I always wonder about this. Um, maybe it make it might make more pollution in that area, which would annoy the bugs in that area more. Hmm. But you're making steel, so we want to make just steel and stone. That's all it is. That's very nice. Very simple. How much rail are we gonna need? A lot. Should I make two things making rail? Uh. Yeah, if you can get like a few next to each other, then absolutely do that. Yeah. Let's get some repair kits in my inventory. So my dudes will repair automatically. That's the other thing the little construction robots do, which is nice. Oh, cool. So they will help to pick up some of the slack. Ideal. Engine units. Yeah, that's this. So engine units are being made, which is great. I, th I think there used to be a thing that they couldn't be made in factories, but maybe they can now. Uh, and then I just need loads of steel plates, and then that's the locomotive. The cargo wagon does not need engines, so I just need to make enough. Does it need anything else? Does it need like wheels? Yeah, yeah. You can't make these in your. You can't handcraft engine units, so that's why I'm having to do it like this. Right. Um, it needs. No, the locomotive doesn't need wheels. No, it needs uh. <laughs> Steel plates, <laughs> engines, and electronic circuits. Which I feel like it would need wheels. It needs we yeah, wheels. That makes sense. <laughs> that does totally make sense. But no, it doesn't. Turns out, no. Oh, there you go. I can make the train. And I'm going to make th four cargo wagons to go on it. Is that the right amount? That's what I'm doing. Okay, cool. That's that done then. So I just want you to wait for that to happen. Steel beams are me quite slow, so I'm making a bunch of these factories. Oh, but then I need a train station, don't I? Um, oh, yes. Oh, how do I get that? Is that a different um, tech? I don't remember. It can't be. You oh, it is. I need automated rail transportation. <laughs> what? Do we have to do it on us by ourselves? Well, no, the, the, so trains let you unlock driving it back yourself <laughs> but this is the one which actually has stations okay um, I'm going to have to start cutting down some trees so the train can come in as well okay um, what I'm going to do is I'm actually just going to make a mark on the map so I'm going to use the deconstruction planner on the map oh god which I think you can do yeah you can within range of your zone so I can make a mark which is like this is where the train line's gonna be. Here. Okay, so I need to head this way. Well, I need to, make, I need to start making also making bullets, so also I think we're gonna need a fucking thousands of these. <laughs> we're gonna need so much rail. It's one block per rail. Yeah, it's not great. Oh my god, there's so much cliff in the way. <laughs> it's like we're like in a flipping divot here I think we might have to do the refining here down in this section uh, that's all good then and it comes all the way down and this is where it makes bullets Boom. is that where the bullets have been made sure yep. and then the second tier bullets need these bullets and steel okay we've got steel yeah, uh, armor piercing out rifle magazine, steel plate, and yeah, so just steel plates as well. So yeah, it shouldn't be too hard for you to. So does rifle? Can you put armor piercing rifle magazines into the submachine gun? Uh, do they use rifle ammo? Um, they yes. Use... Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yes, cool. then. Bah. So that's just use that uses coal and these is copper. Uh, needs copper plates as well. We don't have them on the bus. Oh, what, what, regular rifle magazine? Yeah. No way! Yeah. Copper plates? No, you're joking. Copper plates, mate. I reckon I can get those on the bus in no time. Just you watch. No trouble, <laughs> mate. You want copper plates? I got you copper plates sorted. I got you joy for copper plates. Copper Here plates they come. Days. Great. Right, now what we are going to have to do... Is do some more steel to the top. fancy footwork. Or Have you got that. another one of those? Yeah. Thank you. Can you put it? There you go. That works. <laughs> it's not. It's not again. I'm not. I'm. I'm messing up your lovely system. It's. It's not. It's not the prettiest. 
but I think this is sort of generally the 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 way to do it, right? Yeah. Give yourself a bit of breathing room. Oh my god, why have you squeezed this steel right up here? Because I didn't know how much I. I, I oh, I see. I right. I needed so two, just temporary. Okay, no, I needed I see. two more to like, keep up with the the rail supply. Oh my god, we got thousands of rails in here, Duncan. Yeah. This is amazing. We're gonna have this railway set up in no time, mate. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna start going and setting it up right now. Uh, I also need to give it iron, of course. Let's give it some iron. Is it iron? Does it need iron plate. That is iron plate. Yes, good. So this will be the railway. Um, do we want it to turn around at the end? Do we want it to loop? Turn around. I think we do want it to loop. I think we want to have the factories set up. Loops of loops of on fun. this side. Actually, do we want to? Yeah, we'll have this side as spare, and this side is where the forges will be, right? Yeah. Forges moving out to the right, whereas left hand side will be space for us to expand the factory down later on. Yes. Cool. Bullets are happening. They're not very fast. Why not? I don't like my first attempt at a railway shape. I <laughs> 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 didn't like it. It looked weird. <laughs> Try again. Can I see? Oh, yeah. That's nice. Has it got a nice strength bit for the, for the station? Yeah, it does. Okay, Good. we've got a train stop. So we'll have the train stopped here. Boink, like that. And that's where the train will, will stop. And then I'll put the train down just to test it works. And put Build the a locomotive. In. Okay, that's three. That's three carriages is all it can handle, which is fine. Well, there's lots of ammo here. Oh, wow, there will be. There isn't yet. I think we've got plenty of train lines. I think you can turn that off. Yeah? Yeah, I think we're going to have enough. I've still got like a thousand track on me. But I am going to need all of the infrastructure to build this. So I'm going to need loads of electric mine drills. Okay, build those. Up. I've got them on me at the moment. I'm going to need um, a load of chests. A load of probably steel chests. But I could use the warehouse, actually. Um, and then I need to build the infrastructure at this end. Why steel chests? Because they're a lot bigger. They hold a lot more... Yeah, but we're hardly using all the capacity anyway. Oh, no, but when I... What you need to do is, because the train doesn't... Like, loads and then unloads. Right. Oh, because it has to fit a lot in from each load. Yeah, yeah, you have to, like, put it all into chests and then unload it all at chests at the other side. And I think we can we can use these containers to do that. But steel chests are quite good for it. I think we'll use steel chests to begin with. Okay, I'm going to... I'm going to set up some crap furnaces old school furnaces down here um, for the stone bricks I think stone bricks are one of these things that's only used for um, buildings but it might be used for concrete as well actually we, we have these trains come in delivering their materials right yeah we need to have a sensible plan for what is being done where right like, do, is there a train? Is there? I guess there needs to be different stations dropping off for different materials, right? So we want like yes. iron to drop off you here. You can't just have it all in one station. And then we want like ideally, I guess we want like iron dropping off here. And we want like something else dropping off somewhere else. You see, what I'm saying like if we drop off iron yeah. here, then where, where do we drop off copper? Where do we drop off stone? Where do we drop off oil? Um, you have to have different stations, yeah. Ideally, different trains. Well, they could use the same line, but I just need to like think about how it offloads the stuff, right? Mm -hmm. Like, so if we have this, a load of fast inserters here, this is all gonna have to be upgraded, um, dropping off the iron. So we might even be able to use loaders here. I'm not sure. I'll have to see. I think I might be able to use loaders to drop stuff off these trains. I don't know how quickly- Oh, cool. yeah, yeah, of course. How quickly that will load and unload. But I assume it'll be something like this, and then it'll go It'd through into... I guess loaders are like conveyor belt fast, right? That's the whole point. Yeah. And then we want that to like have, like go, have like enough space to go into 
the furnaces. Um, and maybe like the furnaces are like here, the iron ones. Can you make? Yeah. Can I make okay. what? No, so I'm, I'm asking if you could like if you can tell a inserter to pull off from a certain side of the belt rather than just dump onto. No, I don't think so. That's a great. That's a great suggestion though, and I'm sure there's a mod for it. Mm. <laughs> Because that that essentially makes a belt like into two belts. <laughs> so that's the stone one. So there's three platforms, and they come up here, and then they can come back down. And then they come back down here, and there's a, there's there'll be another one for oil, I think probably. So let's just put that in as well while I'm here. <laughs> Why not? Fuck it. I've got. To, I've, I'm future future proofing. I know. And well, I'm trying to as well. But it just means that everything's got more production, and we haven't got enough resources to feed it. I think I'm going to put down this brick factory just here, or for for temporary use, God, just to get some pain. stone bricks being made for now, so we can make the better furnaces. Um, that was a right faff getting those getting those circuits here. <laughs> which ones? I had to get so this green circuits. They come in. You see where they come in. I had to get them to go up as well so they can get to this factory. Oh, yes, <laughs> that is. Um, that would have been easier if you'd just done these longer, though. Well, it works fine. No, but like. You're doing everything on the absolute minimum short, and as a result, you're just making it really difficult for yourself. Look, that would that look how much easier that is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> if if you weren't it involved moving, if you weren't using such stuff. minimally short underground belts, <laughs> everything would be a lot more straightforward. <laughs> oh, there you go. All right. Well, we're making rank two. Of everything. Uh, of everything. Oh, very cool. I'm going to need a lot of these rank 2 loaders for sure. We, we won't be making any rank 2 belts until the rank, all the rank 2 underground belts are done. Make sure to make sure you, you put limits on these things. Um, I've just done it. But we don't want to be able to f accidentally fill a chest full of splitters. No. Yeah, two squares is enough for these things. Yeah, one for me, one for you. Yeah, yeah, that's plenty, isn't it, for any of these? I think. How how often do you need more than a full stack of splitters? Like pretty rare. Um, pretty mm. rare, I imagine. Yeah, I need I need um, I do need some some of these bad boys. Are all of your conveyors being made into? Oh no, there's, there's some here some as well. Here. But yeah, they are for now. But when they when they're just filled, then the conveyors will get made lots okay cool um i'm i for one feel like we're in a good place yeah i think we're making everything we got lots of ammo we should have lots of ammo now let's go and check and then we're ready to embark upon a distant journey oh yeah look at all that all oh, those bullets yeah i want i just basically need to i think what we need to go is go and set up the iron mine we need to ride the train down to set up the iron mine kill everything on the way ride the train back Oh, sorry, load the train, if we can, with whatever we need. Bring it back and try and then un unload it. <laughs> That's the current process. Yeah. And then rig up a brand new mega steel furnace factory of doom. Oh, my God, we need coal as well. Hmm. well there's, there's, there's another coal mine that's not too far away. Yeah, that's true. But the, the, the these furnaces do need coal. I suppose we can bring it from various places. It's all it's kind of coal's already kind of here anyway. It's kind of I've already got a conveyor running it through the entire base anyway. Yeah. So just upgrading that is probably a we just add more to probably it, a yeah. cheap salute cheap 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 fix. And then really just seeing if we can flood the base with iron. Like really just really just like every bit of the base wants to be like this this here, there's just like look how much iron actually is coming in. It's such a trickle. It needs to be like a full, faster. This is the slowest conveyor. This is not where we need to be. 
we are ready for more. Our base is ready to breathe. Um, Taking out this bug base. <laughs> okay, do you want me to come down? No, it's only one one lump. Ah, oh, okay. Shall we do? We'll do the big great train journey next time. Yeah. We'll have a break now. And come back to it. All right. Bug base is gone. Do I have to remove the ship? For, although, do they respawn? So if yeah, I in the bottom, the alt try alt C for the creep collector. Or I'm just gonna alt D with my robots. That works too. Yeah, either, either one. However you want to do it. I, for one, I'm very excited about the prospect of this future. I think this is a this is a solid start of a factory. We save five hours in. We've got. A, <laughs> it's a solid start. The framework is really good, though. Like I think yeah. it's, we're ready to launch ourselves into the next tier. Um, it is going to need that is going to need to be a continued growth of many aspects, but um, you know the next tier of the next tier of circuit boards, blue ones, but also all of the um, all the oil. Is gonna make us like get, get us into a really good shape. I don't think we even need to. I think we can might be able to get cliff. Hang on, let me just look up cliff explosives. Yeah, cliff explosives we can get within the current tech level. So that will let us clear out. Oh, so we can start this, making space for the trains. Yeah, it will let us clear out a lot of areas and um, tidy up, tidy up the base, so I don't have to have this good. random bit of cliff in the middle of my nice organized systems. Yeah. But yeah, like we could. There's so much space to add a lot more. Um, we just need we just need the input really to do it. Uh, and 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 I I I think we can do it. Well, thank you very much for joining me, Lewis, for some more Factorio. Mm -hmm. I hope you guys at home are enjoying this because uh, we are. And we'll see you again next time. Yeah, see you then. Good goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs>